In this video, revealing how to make money with Amazon for complete beginners and how complete beginners earning $100 to $700 a day with no experience. More at that after the intro. Hey guys, Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, which is the fastest and easiest way to make money online. So sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days with this new method now. So I remember when I first heard of the Amazon opportunity, and quite frankly, I was completely afraid because I had no idea or no experience on exactly how to get started, right? And this was way before I started even surrounding myself around success. Like before I started this YouTube channel, before I even started interviewing really successful people like this 11 year old girl that turned on $30 million that lives here in Bali, as well as this guy that makes a million dollars a month profit. I was just kind of like stuck with me and my dad with a bunch of like debt that was kind of like suffocating us just trying to get freedom for ourselves, right? So we literally bought a bunch of like Amazon courses and tried a bunch of things and we learned a lot of things. We ended up making some money, but ultimately we also lost a good amount of money from these mistakes that I wanna make sure that you guys don't actually make yourself. And this is exactly the video that I wish I had if I was just a complete beginner that had no experience whatsoever to get into e-commerce so that you know you could start creating freedom for yourself. Like how I literally went from, for example, stuck in a cubicle that I did not enjoy to literally just grabbing my ukulele and just taking a one-way trip to get around the world uh, with the freedom that e-commerce and online marketing allowed me to go ahead and do. But like I said, when people get started, they get overwhelmed. They're like, man, do I need money to get started? Do I need skill sets? Do I need time? What if I don't have any of those? Well, in today's video, it doesn't matter if you don't have any of those things, you can still make money with Amazon. And that's step number one, understanding what Amazon actually is. Now, people kind of like overcomplicate things. They're like, okay, Amazon is about buying a bunch of products from China and then spending a lot of your own money and then shipping it over to Amazon and then hoping and praying that you'll get rich. And that's what I thought it was. And that's what brutally destroyed me and made me and my dad lose a bunch of money, a lot of time, a lot of effort, and a lot of heartache. Because we thought that the name of the game and the business model to make money on Amazon is the inventory management part of things. But that's not actually the most important part. In business in general, there's really only two things, sales and marketing. And if you understand that, you know the inventory is just kind of like a small subsection of that. Now the beauty of the Amazon opportunity is sales is already existent. I mean, Amazon does the selling for you. You literally go ahead, people like are crackheads when they come to Amazon. People coming here buying toilet paper because they have a problem and they don't need to be sold anything because Amazon is trustful, it's credible, people already buy a lot of things from Amazon. So the barrier of uh, people to go ahead and buy is very, very low. Does that make sense? Now the marketing is very simple. Amazon is a search engine. Meaning if you rank for any keywords that pop up, like for example, uh, toilet bowl cleaners, right? If you go ahead and rank for a specific keyword, that keyword is kind of like real estate where if someone goes ahead and buys that specific product, you know, because you own that piece of real estate on the first page of like Amazon, Amazon does the shipping, handling, customer service, all of that stuff. And all you have to do is rank for certain keywords that don't have that much competition, which leads me to the second step. And that's understanding which has high competition and which has low competition. And if you want to make money with Amazon, you got to really understand those two things. Because when I first wanted to make money with Amazon, I was like, okay, let me go ahead and go for grill mats. Why? Because every single course and every single, you know, video was talking about grill mats and then BBQ gloves. These were the other ones that I tried selling on Amazon. Now granted, when I first started selling, it was like years ago, uh, nearly half a decade ago when there wasn't that much competition, right? But even though there wasn't that much competition, there was still a lot of reviews that people had. Now it's almost impossible because you could see the top ones, I mean 13,000 reviews, uh, 4,000 reviews, 300 reviews, 4,800 reviews. It's literally a price war where they're all essentially the same product and they're all racing themselves to be the cheapest amongst the all, right? And I remember these guys. These guys were literally there when I first got started and they now have like 6,000 reviews. So it's almost like impossible to go ahead and go against these people unless you variate yourself with you know, a different style of product. Like you could see this is a different style, right? But you could see it only has four reviews, but then again, also it's like an Amazon product. So maybe they're a little bit biased on which products they sell compared to like if someone else were gonna go sell their products or if you know, like someone like me and you were gonna go ahead and compete against them, we would literally have to go against all these things that have thousands and thousands of reviews. So that would be way too competitive. But if you literally just keep on searching, there's a lot of gold in the, the, the entire search engine, right? Like one of the things that I noticed was, for example, Beagle Gifts, 
for beagle lovers. People are searching for that, right? Like I have a beagle dog, I love my beagle, everything is great. Yeah, when I click on that, I realize people are searching for it, but literally on the first page, I mean, you have six reviews right there, 10 reviews, 14 reviews, 52 reviews, and you realize that there's not actually that much competition for some keywords. Some of those are literally like no reviews, especially during the holidays. Um, and you could see that that's even less of a competitive area, right? So if you understand those first two, three steps, you understand that, okay, wow, like Amazon is a search engine, all the sales is done, and all I really gotta do is marketing. Now, the fourth step is understanding that you don't actually even have to invest in your own inventory. Like people are like, oh, I need to go ahead and invest in my own inventory, because that's what all the courses talk about. That's what all the YouTube channel talks about. Oh, saving thousands of dollars, and then going and speaking with some Chinese supplier that barely understands me, and going and making a deal with them where I literally give them thousands of dollars that I've never sent directly to China, which is kind of like sketchy for anyone that's ever getting started online, to hope and pray that they send me you know, a product that not only is in good shape and in good condition, that they didn't you know, like mess up my order or didn't get damaged in, like for example, the shipping over here, but as well as it also sells on Amazon and competition doesn't eat it, right? So there's so many moving parts. So the next step is understanding that you don't actually need to invest in your own inventory. In fact, like with services like merch.amazon.com, we sell products or t-shirt designs that you don't even have to create, or even if you're not a graphic designer, as Amazon products reaching millions of customers worldwide with no often investment or cost to you. All you little gotta do is upload your artwork, set a list price, we print what's sold, fast shipping with Prime. Now, here's the interesting thing, right? How this works is they literally have millions, like just millions of t-shirts that for free you can start selling. And if you make a sale, like if someone comes in here and buys this Beagle t-shirt, Amazon will literally take their t-shirts, they'll print it, and then they'll ship it directly to the customer at no fee to you, and you still get paid passive income from it as if it was an Amazon FBA product. So now your essential goal is, okay, how can I rank for as many keywords as possible and get good at that skill? Because the goal about making money with Amazon as a beginner with no experience isn't like I said, the inventory, it's learning how to rank for low competitive keywords. And you could literally learn by practicing it for free. Right, so one thing that you know we sold back in the day were, for example, cat t-shirts for women funny, right? And I noticed something as simple as this, right? This is literally on the first page, only eight reviews. The other ones are like 100, 200, 300 reviews, but this is only text, right? You could even see that this basically looks like text and yet it's on the first page for this keyword, right? So what some people are doing is they're literally going to Canva, typing create design, typing a t-shirt, and literally with no experience, they're just doing text funny t-shirts based off of like different animals. And you can see if I literally go ahead and like click on one of these templates, right? I could model something similar like this. I'm only talking to my dog today. What if I was like, I am only talking to my cat today, right? And just like that, I have created a t-shirt design that I could go ahead and download Upload it onto merch.amazon.com and rank for a low competition keyword. And just like that, I could already start making money. Does that make sense? Or I could literally come to, for example, Pinterest and get ideas from Pinterest because people save their ideas that they want to go ahead and buy for later on Pinterest, right? Like a lot of women are like, oh my God, I like that. Like click pin, right? Or here in Bali, we have a bunch of friends that literally look at Pinterest for like cool, like travel tattoos. And like you have a bunch of like these dudes with massive Pinterest accounts because they're just looking at something that they want to save to either invest into later or buy later. It's the exact same thing with t-shirts, right? So a lot of people are doing, if they can't create these designs themselves on Canvas, they'll screenshot this, then go to Upwork, type in graphic designer, and once they go ahead and do that, they scroll down and then go to the Philippines because you could get like some of the most affordable help there in the Philippines. And as you know, because my family is Filipino. And as you can see, you could do hourly rate, $10 an hour and below. And when we go over there, you will actually see that some of these people only charge $6 an hour, 100% job success. So that's what a lot of people are doing back in the day. Even what I did back in the day when I was like doing it in the elephant niche, in the Jesus niche, in the cat niche, we were getting it to the point where we're doing $700 a day in revenue with print on demand, selling other people's shirts that I never had to go ahead and for example, you know, do the shipping and handling and all of those logistics, right? And the beauty about you know, Amazon, you can literally get started on merch.amazon for free. And your main skill, if you literally wanna make money 
as a complete beginner with Amazon is just learning how to actually go ahead and rank for these specific keywords. Does that make sense? And the better you get good at ranking for those keywords, the easier that you can actually go ahead and make money with Amazon, which in essence is a secret. But of course, that's just one way to make money online. There's a lot faster and easier ways to make money online without any inventory and without actually creating content or showing your face on camera. And a lot of these people in our community do this. Like Dina, a 47 year old stay at home mom woman, Right, literally went from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks. It's not just her, it's hundreds of other people that were just like you, that watched a video just like this, that took action on this free workshop below to actually go ahead and see the step-by-step -step, uh, entire system. If you wanna know exactly what they did, then sign up for this week's free workshop below. As well, check out this video, this podcast right here. Hopefully this helps, love you guys, see you guys later. Woo!